careful now. Don't wake Granny. Ooh, what does this button do? Oh no! Her hard candies! Looks like we woke the other one too. In Granny's day, they didn't have fancy board games. Look, she'll show you how to make your own fun. It's the Opila bird, in cardboard form. And it looks like it's feeding time. Just leave some candy for the rest of us. Wow. Chopsticks? Oh, glow stick chopsticks! Enjoy your favorite noodles. Or just go to a nice dance party. Either way, seems like a great time. Of course, Grandma prefers to eat with a friend. This doll may be dressed for the occasion. But she's not just the guest of honor. No, she's going to be our new utensils. Make like ballet class and do a little twist. Mmm. Still, could use a little more salt. Wow, now that's what I call a gummy worm. Ladies, please, there's plenty to go around. In fact, why don't we slice it all up? Now they're gummy buttons. Just the thing to sink your teeth into. But Nana's got her own recipe. To make a whole colony of worms. Crunch up some cookies for a little dirt pudding. Now it's time to start cleaning your plate. Mmm, tomato juice. But you should really aim for the cup. Maybe this drink dispenser should help. Just pour and it goes right into the cups. Ooh, this would be great for guests. But if you don't have this cool tool, don't worry. Just poke holes in a paper cup. And add a juice or soda bottle inside. Great idea! Add some straws. Twist the top, and the fountain's running. Probably should keep some cups handy. Where do you get all these tiny glasses anyway? I've heard of lady fingers, but not like this. Wait a minute. Those are some sneaky sausages. And this'll cut it up into bite-sized pieces. Do you think Grandma will want some? No, she's got her own idea. Add metal wires to the end of a baster. And run the hot dog through. Wow. They're like French fried frankfurters. Try saying that five times fast. <laughs> Don't worry, our peanut butter machine isn't really scary. Unless, of course, you're a peanut. So, do you prefer chunky or smooth? Who told you he wouldn't bite? Well, I meant to. Granny, on the other hand, is a different story. And what big teeth you have, Grandma! All the better to open this melted chocolate. Use it to draw anything you want over ice. Oh, a spider web! Just the thing for some spooky cupcakes. Hmm. 
an egg mold? Well, let's get cracking. <laughs> now dunk in some boiling water. Good thing we've had some cooking. <laughs> Just look at all the shapes you can make. But Nana has her own method. Take some foil and bend it into a shape. You can even separate the yolks. Ooh, I've got my eye on this egg. Talk about a seafood diet. Granny prefers food with a face. Uh-oh! Who knew there was such a thing as too much syrup? Try this dispenser. You can make a bunch of jelly flowers. Perfect thing for dipping cookies. When you run out of milk. Now it's Granny's turn. She's got her 3D pen. Yeah, this grandma's a real tech whiz. What's that she's drawing? Whoa, a skull! Starting to see where Wednesday here got her spookiness. Mm, fries! And it's great for dipping, too. What a cute pig. Let's feed it seeds. Must be a blowhole situation. Ooh, the swine shells the sunflower seeds. Now try saying hmm. that one five times fast. Ooh, messy. It's okay. All you need's a plastic bag. It's like a bib you hang on your ears. Chew on those seeds and spit them out. I wonder if this works with watermelon. Well, when life gives you lemons, you know the rest. Let's start squeezing. Have we collected enough juice? Wow. Yeah, she likes her lemon juice nice and tart. Grandma prefers to use the tops of old bottles. But either way, orange juice straight from the source. Extra pulp, just the way Nana likes it. Why don't you try? Well, I guess Grandma knows best. Wow, this girl sure is living la vie en rose. In other words, she likes to think pink. Strawberry meringue. <laughs> that sure can cook. This girl prefers the bright side of the dark side. Like a whole lot of dark chocolate. With a cute little pug right on top. And don't forget the nuts. Make like a dog and dig in. Well, to each their own, I guess. Uh. Order anything? Hmm. Well, she could eat a chocolate burger. <laughs> with chocolate fries. And a cute chocolate sauce rosette. Even dipping sauce can be fancy. <laughs> and more importantly, oh so delicious. Now let's try that chocolate burger. Don't forget, you can even eat the french fry holder. Our pink friend looks jealous. I can see why. Maybe we can help liven it up with a secret ingredient. Pink lemonade. Give that egg a good soak. Keep on stirring. Wow, it's like an Easter egg. 
Now to give new meaning to the egg sandwich. It's cute, pink, and perfectly bite-sized. So take a bite, why don't you? Mm, it's good to the last yolk. For our next food challenge, we've got black noodles. Why are they so hard to open up? Well, at least we got it out. Now, put on a plate and add some cheese. Now grab your chopsticks and get slurping. Okay, Pinky, it's your turn. This pasta looks, well, adequate. But we can do better than that. Let's start with some juicy dragon fruit. But we can't waste good pasta. So take the fruit and mash it up. Now add a scoop of Greek yogurt. Blend into a nice creamy sauce. Ooh, I think it's almost ready. Now drizzle it over those noodles. Spread it all over. And don't forget a little garnish. And it tastes great. Next up, Pinky has a jelly hand. Though I think it's more her style. But she's not done. She must like it. She put a <laughs> ring on it. And you need nails to get a manicure. Speaking of which, it could use a file. Mm, nothing beats a good lady finger. Except maybe a chocolate ring. Now it's time for a hands-on approach. And here, there's enough to share. Guess she's a pinky picky eater. Besides, she's cooking something else up. A little jelly spider is the secret ingredient. Press the button for instant face mask. Peel it off and try it on for size. It's just what your pores needed. See? You can feel your new skin. Of course, this is still a food challenge. Bon Appetit! One of these colas is not like the others. Because it's chocolate. And filled with candy. Why not try the direct approach? After all, you'll get to the candy a lot faster. Okay, no more Mrs. Nice Goth. Break it open like your very own piñata. It's Pinky's turn. She's got a pink box. Complete with pink chocolate pumps. You think we should try them on? Oh, it's that glass slipper all over again. And you got candy on your hands. And it tastes delicious. Have a bite. Watch them go from heels to flats. Now let's try out a little experiment. Fill them up with all sorts of candy. Now pour in your favorite soda. 
<laughs> Add a straw and have a drink. Now, why don't you have a bite? Just make sure it's dry first. Next up, popcorn. Plain popcorn. A little too plain. Okay, Pinky, it's time to batter up. Of course, it's always nice to share. Wait, something's inside the popcorn. It's an ear of pink corn. Just her style. Let's add some pink sauce, too. And some multicolored sprinkles. What? Does everything have to be pink? Then again, her face is about to be... Ooh, a birthday melon! Aren't you gonna blow it out? Look, it's full of black jelly! Why not have a slice? How about a quick candy dip? Okay, I'm sure we can do better than that. Coat it like cheese on a slice of pizza. But you probably can't eat the crust. Ooh. An apple for Ms. Newton. Add a stick and dip in some black caramel. While we're at it, add some toppings. Oh, I just love abstract art. But now it's time for a bite. And another. And another. Ooh. I think she likes it. Looks like Pinky likes apples too. Slice it up and add to some dough. Roll it up into a nice floral shape. We're making an apple rosette bouquet. Now why don't we add some cinnamon on top? After baking, they're ready for the big taste test. Ooh, it certainly got appeal. Oh, looks like Grandma's got a visitor. Wow, that's a lot of food. Wait, did you see any German brothers and sisters on the way here? Mm, maybe she's just a sweet old grandma. But seriously, either way, don't go near the oven. Time for Grandma vs. Gadget's Showdowns! Stay tuned for the bonus episode, too. Separating the yolks from the whites. <laughs> Kinda makes you wish they were just sold separately. Oh! Looks like a cross between Birdo and Babe. But it sure does get the job done. It's almost clean off! Huh. I wouldn't think to pair eggs with something that looks wow. like a pig. Well, maybe with a side of bacon, or ham, or sausage. Nothing like a relaxing night watching a movie together. Uh-oh, they're out of popcorn. Don't worry, we've got you covered. Cue the next gadget. Just pour in the kernels and push the button. You can already hear everything popping. Just keep that cover on, or the whole room's gonna get covered in popcorn. Ah, oh. oh, it's still spilling! Good idea. Add it to this giant bucket of... Oh, wait a minute. Eh, I guess you can never have too much popcorn. After all, you don't want to run out again. Mmm, potatoes. So delicious, but so hard to peel. Hmm, she had an idea, and I don't think it's just to make rice instead. It's a new gadget. 
you get a peeled potato and a really long potential french fry. But why stop at potatoes? Let's see what else this baby can peel. Remember, you peel it, you eat it. Aw, oh, some fruit should be nice after all that junk food she gave you. In other words, Granny's on a health kick, and we gotta be sneaky about our sweets. Let's just hope that this device can help us. Wow, it gives you a hollowed out banana. Still, let's not let all that good banana go to waste. But now for what we came for, using our banana's secret hiding place. Cue the Nutella. I've heard of chocolate covered bananas before, <laughs> but not banana covered chocolate. Come on, like you can really keep a secret from Granny? It's tea time. Some herbal tea can be a really good choice. Look at those leaves. Ew, a tea leaf. Oh, it looks like she's got something up her sleeves. A pink elephant? Oh, I see, it holds the leaves for you. So this way, all you get is just the nice smooth tea. comes in so many different flavors, from squirrel to manatee. Collect them all. Poor Nana, all those birthdays and no one's gotten her an electric mixer? Don't worry, you don't always need something electric to make things easier. Just watch, we can even mix the ingredients inside this giant bottle. Don't get any eggshells inside. And shake it. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. Really getting our money's worth out of these cookie cutters. Ooh. Mmm, there Grandma approved. Microwaves make cooking easier. But they're such a pain to clean. Hey! Angry Mama? Are you sure? We might need Angry Grandma or even Great Grandma level. Don't let anyone know that's not her real hair or she'll get really angry. Don't let the mess intimidate you. She looks like a fighter. What? Did you think she'd just do the whole thing for you? She just made it a little easier. Time for cake. It's no one's birthday, but Grandma knows you don't need an excuse for cake. Don't worry, they even have a gadget to help you serve cake. Seriously, there's something for everything. Look at how tightly it hugs the piece of cake. And don't forget the best part. You get to lick the device at the end. I knew I should have called dibs. Time for another snack. Ooh. Some fresh, healthy cherries. Oh. oh no, a lost tooth. I knew we should have stuck to cake and ice cream. Either way, we've come prepared. A handy dandy cherry pitter. Oh. Granny seems impressed. Guess she has to watch out for her dentures. B -b -b Bonus episode. Uh -huh. When you can't decide between a ball pit or a pool, why not both? What a cute little whatever it is. What's she gonna do with it? 
Ooh, it's like a tiny little doorknob. But something tells me it won't be tiny for long. Told ya. But what are we gonna do with it? Throwing them on the wall? Kinda reminds me of that carnival game. Except the balloons are the darts. Wait a minute. So that's how you make that toy from before. I was wondering how they were connected. And now you can make a whole team of them. Grand-sational stuff. Catch you next time. Well, either way, this is perfect for a bite-sized treat. Of course, Grandma has her own way of doing it. Just twist up an old fork, and it slices just like that. Always nice to go for a stroll in the crisp fall air. Uh-oh, looks like someone needs to go on the go. Luckily, she came prepared. It's a tent. This should give her some privacy. But hurry! <laughs> Let's hope she remembered TP and hand sanitizer. Grandma is fine with a sheet and some clothespins. Anna is nothing if not frugal. Huh, well, this could probably tide her over till lunch. Do you need antacid? Oh, never mind, it's just a melon. Let's slice it up. And we've got the perfect gadget. Grandma's really into those Bond movies. And just like Bond, she's got her own special gadgets. A blade, a pipe, and gravity does the work for you. Whatever happened to good to the last drop? Don't worry, your grandkids here to help. Just slice up the fruit. Add to a juicer. And enjoy that freshly squeezed taste. Hey, aren't you gonna share with Grandma? Well, she's got a few Ooh. tricks up her sleeve. All you need is a syringe. Fill it up with strawberries and start pressing. Uh, sure you don't want a cup? Either of you? Our chef here is making dumplings. Wrap it up. Eh, just don't squeeze out the filling. Maybe we should just order a pizza? Oh, good idea. This dumpling maker should help. Doesn't push too hard, and they come out looking great. Grandma has her own secret dumpling trick. Fold it up and use a fork to give it texture. But her secret recipe for filling stays a secret. Oh no! A bug! And right on her skirt, too! It's okay, she came prepared. A bug catcher. Just press the button and away it goes. Uh-oh. Almost forgot some bugs can fly. Calm down. Nana's got a secret weapon. A matchbox. The perfect trap. Just slide that bugaboo inside. 
Mmm, sushi. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, she brought her own chopsticks. Though they're the kind made for beginners. <laughs> Think training wheels, but for utensils. Besides, Grandma has her own tricks. Cloth napkins. Roll it up, and the chopsticks are attached at the hip. Of course, nothing beats just practicing. Rhinestones. They're not just for costume jewelry. They can give your face a little sparkle and shine. Just try not to immediately scratch it all off. Here's an idea. Cut a sponge into a shape. Add makeup, and it's a cute little stamp. Just don't go nuts or it'll look like chicken pox. Speaking of which, she should really get that itch checked out. Now, now, Nana knows best. You need your five a day. Meet her halfway. Eat your greens, but have fun. Add a cuke to this device and start carving. It's a spiral. Almost like eating pasta. And there's no shame in washing it down. But if you wanted spirals, all you had to do was ask. Make some cuts to an old soda can. Twist your cucumber on top. And you get spirals. With a nice hint of cola. Of course, cukes aren't just for eating. Spa day! Naughty puppy! We don't eat your kibble! Guess she'll have to get a new snack. This kebab maker should help. Add meat. Lots and lots of meat. Just the way she likes it. Grandma has other ideas. No wonder she drinks so much soda. Fill the bottle with meat. Add a stick and squeeze. Ah, looking good. Just don't forget to cook it up. Mmm. Now, pass the ketchup. Huh? Hungry again? Of course, there's always room for sushi. This should help. First, add the rice. Now, some sashimi, like this salmon. Maybe some greens, like avocado slices. Close it up and squeeze out on some seaweed. I don't think it was supposed to come out like that. Luckily, we've got a master chef in our corner. Just place the ingredients in an ice cube tray. Why not fill the whole tray? Add the rice last. Flip it over and voila! You've got sushi. So he said, but then she said, oh, wait, hold on. So when's your next dentist appointment? Hmm, maybe some whitening strips could help. Just place on top of your teeth. Give it some time and peel away. Already looking much better. Does Nana want to try it out? Nah, she's got her own trick. Activated charcoal. Just chew it like gum and rinse. Gotta have some tricks with all... Well, would you look at that? Grandma laid an egg. Well, it sure beats paying those store prices. What?
Oh, I think someone's at the door. Who is it? Hmm. Well, whoever it was, they left their backpack. Let's take it inside. Hmm. Meanwhile, we also gotta separate these eggs. Mm, gesundheit. Oh, it looks like Mr. Backpack can help. Hey. A yolk separator. Yes. Try it out. Just crack an egg on top. Now it's time to get things running. Oh. Pour out those yolks. We're making meringues. Mmm, corn. Time to sink your teeth in. Oh, I didn't mean it like that. Well, it's okay. Make like a banana and peel that corn. I wonder what else it can peel. Give it a good squeeze. Oh no! Your glasses! And you can't see a thing without your glasses! When did that pigeon get in here? Oh wait, that's no bird, it's a gravy boat! But it's not just for gravy, add that lemon! We've got juice! Now perk up that tea! Mmm, good to the last drop! Huh, maybe we should have started with donut holes. Or maybe we just need the right tool. Good thing we still got all this batter. Give it a push and the donuts just plop out. Flip them over once they're golden brown. They're ready. Once it cools, take a bite. Of course, we can't forget about <laughs> topics. Especially sprinkles. This carrot needs some tenderizing. Or better yet, mashing. Add some inside. And squeeze until it comes out like Play-Doh. Try this on all your favorite veggies. But the real fun comes next. Getting to eat. <laughs> Careful, stay inside the bowl. <laughs> the bowl. Okay, that whisk isn't cutting it. Or whisking it. This sauce stirs great for a hands-off experience. Just make sure to keep an eye on it. Now you've got a date with some sauce. Meanwhile, let's catch up on some knitting. It's time to grate some cheese. Careful. Little more. Huh, barely made a dent in those hot dogs. Don't worry, we can always try a little hand guard. Now you can grate anything you want. Granted, not everything needs to be grated. Gummy worms should be eaten al dente. Mm, noodles, and we've got oodles. You know, it's even more fun to eat it. Uh -oh. What a tangled web she weaves. This looks like a job for our T-Rex chopsticks. It's a utensil that works on both ends. Great for those hard to reach bites. Huh, first Jack Horner in that pie, now this. If you're gonna stick your thumb in food, you're gonna need some help. It's slicing with a hands-on approach.
and it'll let you tackle the whole produce aisle. Now everyone will want to peel potatoes. Who needs a green thumb when we've got orange? Aww. Just don't forget to eat the food when you're done. Wow, I never saw cookie dough leak before. It's not a hair dryer, it's a cookie press. Add whatever cookie cutter design you like. Just press. And pretty soon, we've got cookies. Look, it can be as easy as stamping. And I think we've got some left over, too. Ah, bread and butter. So simple, and yet so good. No wonder Madeline eats it every day. If only the butter could actually spread. Luckily, butter lipstick runs smooth. Well, that'll wet your whistle. But let's save some for the toast. Get into every nook and cranny. Nah. Now let's try some English muffins. Ooh, and a bagel. <laughs> Time to drain the pasta. Oh, whoops. Oh, uh, so Ew. who wants pizza? Come on. Oh, wait. Hey. Maybe this pasta strainer can help. Just add to the side and pour. The pasta's safe and sound. <laughs> and I've got a great sauce recipe. <laughs> Ooh, Grandma's mastered the whisk. Just in time for her special cookie recipe. Of course, right now it's in more of a pancake stage. But that's nothing <laughs> our cookie stamp press can't fix. And look at all the different stamps. Now into the oven they go. Why not take a bite? Ah, cookies. So good you can't stop at just one. Some foods mouth watering. Onions aim for the eyes. <laughs> wow, that's pungent. Good thing she's in the shower. Apparently, it's okay. Rubber Ducky's got your back. A new pair of glasses is all you needed. Wow. They'll protect your eyes from watering. So get shopping. It is tea time. Aww. Oh, that's too hot. Let's try something cool. Take this silicone mold and fill it up with tea bags. Aww. Now, if we want to make ice, we're going to need some water. Wow. Gotta love any excuse to use a funnel. Now stick it in the freezer and give it time. Okay, that should be enough time. Let's take these tea spheres out for a spin. Yay! No, not like that. Add it to the water for a brand new twist on iced tea. This'll go great with some green tea ice cream. Grandma marvelous stuff. Catch you next time. Ugh, this bathroom's way too cheery. I mean, look, the toilet's filled with toys. You know, 
Bon Bon here could use a checkup. Mm -hmm. Worms? Well, as Bon Bon says, sharing is caring. We're almost done cleaning you up. Now we can operate. Let's fix this arm. Talk about witches and stitches. Ooh, slime. Let's save that for later. Let's take a look inside, shall we? Is that more worms? Hope Wednesday saved room for dessert. Here, have a new heart, Tin Man. Okay, we just need to stitch you back up. And a band-aid wouldn't hurt either. But you might feel a slight shock. Clear! Watch your step. So much for omelets. Uh-oh, oh, peel a bird. Was that her egg? I'd get out of here if I were you. Maybe we can find some new eggs for her. This bonbon could use a little pimple popping. Make that a lot. Look, they're all different colors deep down. It's kind of like a fun guessing game. Easter came early this year. A locker full of snakes? Nah, nothing strange here. Spiders? Teeth? Eyeballs? Yeah, seems about right. Okay, now things are starting to get scary. Of course, true beauty is on the inside. So let's see what makes him tick. Well, slime is a good start. Another egg. We're on a roll. Think we'll find more? That was quick. Ooh, a pink egg. So close, yet so far. We need help. Like this grabber toy. Time to go on an egg hunt. This should please that Opila bird. And just in time. Look who's here. Told you she liked eggs. Raw, too, by the looks of it. Ooh, I think she wants to repay you. Why, it's an egg she laid herself. Ooh, it looks huh? like it's ready to hatch. <laughs> wow, time sure does move fast. It looks like a security card. Might as well try it out. So bright, so colorful. We're gonna need some sunglasses. I think something's under those boxes. Why look, it's Chef Pigstar. I guess she wants a closer look again. Is anyone else here getting deja vu? Ooh, it looks like there's some prizes inside. Like this rubber ducky. Save it for bath time. That sure is a lot of pink, inside and out. So that's where he keeps his brain. Ooh, a pop tube. Must be the intestine. Now that's one large intestine. What else is inside? A picture of a piece of candy? What could it mean? Wait a minute. The boxes. They're like a puzzle. 
Arrange them like in the picture to make a candy. Okay, something's starting to happen. That box, is there anything inside? Was kind of hoping for candy, but let's try it out. Here, Bon Bon, let's wet your whistle. Oh, sorry, I guess this room's occupied. Wow, there are cobwebs all over this place. Add a few more, and it's just like home. Come to think of it, there's a lot of nice stuff in here. Wrap the pop tube up in aluminum foil. That's just the start. We'll need a lot more foil. And it'd be a shame to let all this blue stuff go to waste. Well, that's one way to make a muscle. Now we need to make a hole in the middle. Talk about a big mouth. It'll need some teeth. And a long pink tongue. Now make some holes for the eyes. All three of them. And a nice big hat. <laughs> Look at that. It's Nab Nab! Huh? What the? Ah, it's an earthquake! <laughs> Quick, take cover! <laughs> oh, happy birthday, Bon Bon. <laughs> Let's find Wednesday. <sighs> there she is. <laughs> Why don't you come out and say hello? Someone sure likes to make an entrance. Oh, wait. What's going on? Things are getting dark. And not the fun kind. What the? Where'd these ropes come from? I think he wants a captive audience for his next science experiment. Hi, Mr. Alien. Time to meet Mr. and Ms. Mortar and Pestle. We just need a few more ingredients. It's just right for our Bonbolina doll. Now we just need our secret ingredient. We're almost done. Bonbon bon just needs a volunteer. Okay, you might feel a slight pinch. Wow, she looks like a bride of Bon 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 Bolina. That's one way to save on a wedding dress. Oh, I don't think that rings candy. Still, a Wednesday without black clothes or pigtails just isn't Wednesday. You know, if you wanted to play dress up, you could have just asked. What'll happen next? Catch you next time. Oh, looks like someone's in trouble. This doll certainly needs a makeover. Dye the hair black and braid it nice and tight. Oops. Oh, pale face and this freezing cold look. It's Wednesday! Wait, is that plastic wrap? And hot glue? Oh, that's a perfect tale. Now, uh -oh. Mermaid Wednesday can explore the depths of the sea. Um, I mean, toilet. Hi, Thing! Where's Wednesday? Oh, there she is. Sorry, Pigtails. She's in the mood for a buzz cut. Chains for hair? Guess we should call her Goldilocks. Shoes are like potato chips. You can't stop at one. 
And I don't mean one for each foot, either. <laughs> Leave the see-through shoes to Cinderella and add color, add sparkles. Oh look, a conveniently placed picnic. But even better, we've got free foil and a brand new top. Let's add pearls. Let's hope you like muffins, cause their wrappers make a nice ruffle skirt. And you've got plenty of lashes to go around. She'll never shop retail again. And for the guys, some hair can cover up that baby face of his. Now let's take some chewing gum and give him some abs. Would you believe he's never been inside a gym? Let's fix up his wardrobe. A glove becomes a stylish suit. For the top, let's draw on the buttons. Why not? People wear tuxedo print shirts all the time. Can't forget the bow tie. Red adds a little color. All this crafting sure is thirsty work. And this cup can help us make a brand new pair of shades. Wow, stop motion! Pulling out all the stops for this wedding. Here comes the bride. At least you got a new dress out of it. Wow, this is just not her day. Barbie's ready for the big Halloween party. Let's go inside. Uh-oh, guess there's a dress code. No pink, but we're about to see red. Here come the tomatoes. Oh, let's get out of here. <laughs> they think they're so spooky. We'll beat them at their own game. This tomato juice makes great fake blood. What else? Whoa, granola dead skin flakes. A little jam for that nice bruised look. Aren't we two-faced? Now for that black eye. A cotton swab can fix your mascara. Ask your mini-me to lend you a hand. Add some lipstick for color. Give your eye a little something special. Ooh, piercings! Let's go with that one. Uh -huh. But do we even have any nose rings? Hmm, let's see. Teddy bear? Banana? Uh -huh. A spiral hair tie? Uh -huh. eh, close enough. <laughs> Break off a small piece and stick it on. Uh -huh. Looks great, <laughs> and it's easy to remove. Next up, we're gonna need a plush toy. You're coming to the party with us. Just need a little fake blood. And you've never been closer. Ooh, a spider! Let's catch it and whip up a hot glue spider web. It'll make a fetching uh. choker. <laughs> Silly spider, you're coming with us. Ooh, now let's fix those nails. Just grab a cocktail straw. And dip it in some nail polish. It's a makeshift airbrush. Almost done, just keep blowing. Ooh, now that's a splatter fest. Uh-oh, you've got a run in your stockings. Don't get mad, just make some more. And they're fingerless armbands. Let's add some glitter. Uh -huh. Use it to cover your hands. Uh -huh. 
Now add some jewels while we're at it. Like a night sky full of stars. <laughs> Next up, grab an old curtain. And why don't we empty those boots? Wow, it's a whole spider family! Now we're gonna need some chains. Just lay them down on the curtain. And start spraying paint on top. When you're done, peel everything off. Cut it out into a nice shape. And you've got a new dress. <laughs> Next, we'll need a skeleton. A closet's always a good place to look. Told ya. Now grab some ribs. <laughs> Add a plastic bag. Some light. And we can see your all heart. And lungs. Ugh, look, a spleen. Shame we can't use these clothes. But those hangers are another story. Fold them up, add some stockings. Twist two of them together and splatter on some white paint. Now let's make some holes. And hook up your new wings. Hey, watch your step. Eh, don't worry, it's just clay. In fact, let's get creative. Smoosh it into shape. Add some paint. And try on your brand new hooves. <laughs> now it's time for some makeup. <laughs> ah, blood red goes with everything. But do you think it's a little much? Nah, of course not. If anything, we need more. More colors, more shapes. And soon, we've got fangs. A nice outline's the finishing touch. <laughs> Hungry? Let's take a snack break. Rats? A skull? Ooh, how about cauliflower? Though it could use some ketchup. Hmm, how about we spread it out nice and thin? <laughs> Pretty soon, it's a new brain. <laughs> and every brain needs a jar. Don't forget some brain juice. Ooh, and eyeballs. All the better to see you with. Seal it up nice and tight. And don't forget some handles. Free brain! Now that's a deal. It sure is windy outside. Probably have to rake the living room. But first, let's color in these leaves. And while we're at it, let's add some googly eyes. Now paint on a nice pair of fangs. And they've become vampire bats. Oh no, you broke a nail. Well, let's just make you a new one. Take some clay and make a whole new finger. Let's make it look absolutely ghastly! Hmm. 
<laughs> like it's just about to fall off. <laughs> and we've got a party to go to and prove who's the real Scream Queen. <gasps> Who is she exactly? That's easy. A gargoyle zombie fairy. <laughs> and your worst nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Witchy Poo, huh? pull her finger. Uh, uh... Look, <gasps> it comes clean off. <laughs> <laughs> And she's brought you guys a present. A free brain. A trick and treat all rolled into one. Always nice to put on a brave face. You just know she wants those shoes. Come on, everybody. It's close to midnight. Let's dance the night away. The beach is filled with all sorts of treasures. Like two dolls. It's a two for one special, especially since they're stuck together. Careful, watch the hair, watch the hair. Well, at least they're free. And now it's makeover time. Let's pop those pimples. <laughs> hmm? And now you get a mask. <laughs> Let the mask work its magic. <laughs> now let's see your pretty face. <laughs> let's see how our other friend is doing. Ooh, she can use a new look too. Grab an old massager. Huh? Clear it off and add shaving cream. Now it's time for a little face scrubbing. Yeah, I think you scrubbed too hard. Eh, no worries. It's right there. Just wipe it back on. And rinse off. Why don't you give us a smile? Ooh, is there a dentist in the house? Well, we can use this hygiene kit. Just look, the toothpaste sparkles. And soon, so will those teeth. Wow! Ooh, this doll could use a new set. Just lie her down, get some white gum, and stretch it out over that smile. Uh -huh. <laughs> Ooh, got any more of that gum? Now for a little hair care. Uh-oh. I don't think we can cover that up. So, why don't we try a blank slate? You know, the top of your head is called a crown. So let's make it your shining glory. With a bunch of rhinestone chains. She's a 24 karat golden blonde. As for your doll, well, at least this dog likes her hair. Guess it makes a nice chew toy. Well, whatever's left of it, I guess. I know. Let's grab a newspaper. Cut out some thin strips. And use the scissors to curl them up. Add them up like ringlets. <laughs> And soon, she'll be a real curly top. Don't forget to add some color. Huh, is it me or does something smell? Yeah, I think we found the source. Empty that container. 
Decorate it with glitter. And jewels in nice shapes. And we can't forget the faucet. Or the water. Cause I think somebody's getting a bath. But you can't have a bath without soap. And a nice brush. Of course, some people prefer to take showers. If that's the case, get some material. That could work for walls. And turn a cap into a shower head. Now we gotta install some plumbing. This straw could make a great pipe. Hook it up. And hang up a curtain. Now let's lather, rinse, and repeat. And remember, nothing beats a good scrub-a-dub-dub. Shopping for gifts can be a lot of fun. But remember, some people prefer cash. So why don't we fold them up into strips? We can use them to make a new dress. Complete with a belt and a bow on top. Oh, Dolly, green really is your color. How about a hand for the designer? You're gonna need some clothes, too. Hmm, what do we have to work with? Ooh, tin foil, and lots of it, too. Rip off a piece and make a skirt. Now cut up some plastic bubbles. For a brand new bikini top. A little more foil and look at you. Do you think she'll start a trend? Ooh, you can use a trim. And not just the dress. It achieves, we're going to need some tape. Extra sticky. You might feel a slight pinch. You know, tape's not the only thing that's sticky. Of course, lollipops are more fun to eat. Still, if you want to give your doll smooth legs, you'll soon find that candy is dandy. It's time to give your doll a new present. Nanotape? Well, we can whip it into shape. Roll it out and add some glitter. Fold it up and make some cuts. Try them on. And add some straps. And try out your new platform shoes. Now that's a lot of earwax. There's enough to make boots. How about some heels? This toothpick's two in one. These boots were made for walking. Guess it's time for a little manicure. Let's clean those fingers. Now grab a glue gun. We can use it to draw out some new nails. Don't worry if they come out too long. We can cut them down to size. The final part, showing them off. Oh, it sure is windy out tonight. Who can sleep with all these free leaves? After all, if you cut them into tiny pieces, 
Your doll's got brand new fake nails. Wow, she really is an autumn. Wow. Oh man, it's even getting cold inside. <laughs> Nothing a faux fur coat can't fix. A new winter wardrobe's just a few cuts away. But with a little imagination, even old gum can make up your new ensemble. Just roll it out nice and thin. And it's time for the old wraparound. Don't forget to add some sleeves. And soon, she's got a new jacket. For these dolls, the world is their runway. Oh, it looks like someone's got a crush. Wow, a hair flip. But can he do it in slow-mo? Uh-oh, looks like you've got competition. Oh no, not liquids, her only weakness. Did I mention she's a mermaid? <laughs> Poor thing, without a leg to stand on. <laughs> hey, be nice. She might know SpongeBob. Well, joke's on them. We're having a beach day. And look, you found a seashell. What the? Ooh, talk about beachfront property. There's even a free treasure chest. Let's try out this pimple popper first. It's time to get scooping, and I don't mean ice cream. Huh? Is she part narwhal? Or is that a fish? Okay, we're gonna need tweezers for this job. Well, fish doesn't get any fresher than this. Done eating? Good. Let's clean those teeth. This special toothbrush should help. Just add toothpaste. Now, get to all those hard-to-reach places in one fell swoop. Uh, let's play it safe with a few more swoops. Okay, that should be enough. Let's see those pearly whites. Who would have thought that an all-fish diet could cause bad breath? Your tongue is in need of a good scraping. Ah, much better. We're back in the pink. Wow, your skin's really drying out. Careful! Don't want you turning into a Fiji mermaid. It's okay. This electric brush should help. Say goodbye to those fish flakes. I mean, skin flakes. We've got a visitor. A snail. And he's treating you to a free massage. <laughs> Did I mention the homemade slime? Ooh, you got the two-for-one special. <laughs> Remember, true beauty's on the inside. So, let's clean out those insides. Those ears could use some sprucing up. Now we can finally start that candle shop. Uh-oh, your mammalian half is showing. Let's try these hair removal strips. Add it down the middle and turn one eyebrow into two. Now let's take care of those whiskers. Uh, 
Ooh, I'd recommend biting down on something. Looks great. Nice and smooth. Next up, this rubber band can help plump out those lips. Eh, you're already part fish. Why not add in a little duck? Oh, you caught a fish in your fishnet. Stocking. Go free, little friend! Oh, never mind. Well, we can have fun with these stockings. Add makeup. And give your face a whole new texture. Looks great. And don't stop at the face. What's next? Ooh, eyeliner stencil cards. Now you can finally paint your eyes to match your cheeks. Let's add some glitter. Or as I like to call it, scales. <laughs> now let's add some pearls. We've got plenty. So pretty, you'll wish you could see your own eyes. But now let's do something about that, do. Then again, maybe the braids weren't so bad. Don't worry, these spiral hair rollers should help. Just roll them onto the hook and run your hair through it. Huh, I like it, very colorful. Oh, right, you're supposed to give it some time to set. And then you take off the rollers. Now your hair has a lot more bounce. And this eyelash glue should help you shape your hair any way you like. Now add some finishing touches. And you've got your very own tiara. Ew, maggots. Got any tweezers? Chopsticks could help if you knew how to use them. Good thing we've got a chopstick holder. Did I mention it's also a giraffe? Maybe save the maggots. We can use them as bait. Uh. This tail could use some light dusting. Uh. Our feather vacuum should fix you right up. Huh. Oh, maybe you dusted a little too hard. It's okay, Nemo's got you covered. More importantly, he's got glitter. A few more squeezes and you'll be sparkling in no time. What's that? Oh no, a fishnet! Well, scissors to the rescue. You know, this fishnet could be a fashion statement. Cut it up a little more and it's a new top. And some shells can help decorate it. Some sea flora also comes in handy if you need a little color. What else can we use? Ooh, a giant clam. We could make a pearl necklace. Or even better, a brand new bikini top. Uh -huh. Oh no, uh -huh. the fishermen are back! And they brought hooks. But maybe we can put them to better use. Uh -huh. Bend them into shape. Add to a plastic tile. Uh -huh. 
Cut around the design and add some glue. Make it shine with some glitter and rhinestones. Wow. Now it's the perfect fin to add behind your ear. Wow, your mermaid makeover is finally complete. Now, how do we get out of here? Okie dokie. Time to show off her new look. Ooh, a hair flip. I see the student has become the master. Looks like he's impressed. And she's threatened. Oh, where does she keep getting water from? Joke's on her. Now she can show off her new tail. Ah, love is in the air. And under the sea. Pretty fishy stuff, but in a good way. Catch you next time. It's trash day. Did the neighbors toss anything good? Poor Dolly. Just look at your poor leg. You're bendable, but not that bendable. You're sweet enough without the wrappers. Now let's ditch these rags. Ew. Wow. Besides, you don't need pants when you're a mermaid. Let's draw up a cool design with some glitter glue. Still, this glitter glue needs more glitter. It's the glitter ratio. Gesundheit. Hmm, that stuff up your nose might come in handy. Ooh, a shell bikini. A mermaid classic. I hear peanut butter could help with that. Or better yet, let's cut it off and start over. We're really saving on supplies these days. This girl could be her own arts and crafts store. Our little mermaid's complete, but let's make her a playmate. I guess he'll do after we clean him up. First, let's whip you up some clothes. Cut up a glove. And it's a new t-shirt. But gloves can be much more than that. Like a stylish pair of blue jeans. Or overalls. There's a glove for every occasion. Ooh, a mustache. Gonna need some hair. Now for some shoes. Just measure, cut them out, and add a little balloon. Now they're the perfect slip-on boots. Add a red cap, and it's a me, Mario! Looks like we've got our next customer. Ugh, so many zits! Well, better get popping. Probably should have put on some gloves. Let's trim a little off that mane, shall we? Time for some cover-up. I don't think we can pass those spots off as polka dots. Now take apart some ribbons. It's just the material we need for new horse hair. Aw, let's brush your little pony. Add a horn, and it's a unicorn! Harness sold separately. Come on, Mario, get up! It's time for a ride! Let's go see that mermaid. Whoops! Ew. Oh, calm down. It's just Play-Doh. Take some more and mix up the colors. And so, it's cake frosting. Just add cake. 
But what's a cake without sprinkles? Uh-oh, I guess Mario's already taken. Oh no! Looks like a storm is brewing. Ooh, you got a hole in your tail. Hmm. Let's whip you up something to help. This detergent bottle can make a nice bathtub. Just add water. Ooh, and a face mask. Now let's scrub away all of life's little barnacles. You know, a haircut wouldn't hurt. Mm, talk about a close shave. You should probably close your mouth. Now it's time to add some glitter. Excuse us, we're gonna need to borrow some toilet paper. Well, really, we just need the roll. Why don't you slip this on for size? This'll decorate that skirt in one fell swoop. These boots will go with your whole, well, you. Ah, instant noodles. What can't they do? Especially when you get it nice and sticky. It's your new hair. Here for a dye job? Oh, you're the devil in disguise. Careful, you just hit someone. Or maybe she heard about all these free doll makeovers. Well, let's get out the shaving foam. And scrub a dub dub your problems away. Oh, great. I could go for a soda break. All right. The wrapper will make a great dress. Some water will help shape it in place. Now cut off some plastic bag handles. Tie them up together all in a row. It's a skirt. Tie it around your waist. Now for some plastic wrap and paper mache. And you got yourself a cap. Seems plain, but that's nothing a few flowers won't fix. Your dress could use some flowers too. Hey, look in the trash. Free money. And more importantly, a plastic envelope. Draw a doll-sized pair of angel wings. Hmm, they need a little color. Also, sparkles. Now try on your new pair of wings. Ah, an angel and a devil. We could find you some shoulders to sit on. But this container makes for a lovely couch. What else can we make for you? Take a green straw and cut it up. Add them to a skewer or chopstick. Tape on some other straw cuttings. Add some brown, and it's a tree. A coconut tree by the looks of it. Why don't we make a whole grove? Come on, everyone, it's party time. Oh. Is everyone enjoying themselves? Yahoo! It sure looks like it. Well, almost. Close enough. Now throw that confetti.
Oh, what a beautiful wedding. Yeah. <laughs> now let's cut the cake. Toad? No! Not the cake! It's the whole reason I came. <laughs> Don't worry. A bride knows to be prepared. She was bound to have a backup. We just need to finish up the decorating. Always great when gravity does the work for you. Now for level two. I mean, layer two. And the cherry on top. Which reminds me, ice cream break. You know, this waffle cone could come in handy. Add candy coating and sprinkles. And it's a castle steeple. Look, cones on cones, some little flags, and a cute little rainbow doorway. This sour roll will make a perfect road. With M&Ms as cobblestone markers. Why pave the streets with gold when you could use candy? A balloon? Hmm, maybe it could help. Dip it in some melted chocolate. And then in some candy pieces. When it dries, pop the balloon. Add a face, and our cake has its own princess too. What? Are the gummy bears having a picnic? No time for that. We need to get them ready. Wow. We have a groom. Yeah. Aw, isn't he sweet? Our cake toppers are complete. Oh, chocolate, the king of sweets. We haven't forgotten huh? about you. Uh -huh. hmm. <laughs> First, let's have ourselves a treat. Uh -huh. <laughs> Pour it on some ice, and you can write whatever you want. Aw, say it with love. And even better, <laughs> chocolate. <laughs> Yeah! The sky is falling! Wait, it's a mystery box. Filled with cherry tomatoes? Slice it up and you can make a heart. Keep it in place with some toothpicks. Let's make a bunch for the bride and groom. Oh, Mr. Horse wants to be part of the wedding? Let's get you ready. First, your hair. Add a horn, and he's a real unicorn. Now let's shine those hooves. Hmm, what else can we add? I know, take a marshmallow and cut it up into petal-like pieces. Add to a lollipop, and it's a flower. Just make sure it's nice and sticky. <laughs> now our garden's full of flavor. <laughs> Time for a whipped cream break. You know, the cake could use some too. Ooh, rainbows! How does your garden grow? Look, a banana? Always good to add fruit. And bananas do have a lot of appeal. Waka waka! Don't eat it just yet. Slice it up. Mm, there's enough for a quick snack. And enough to dip in some candy. Take some edible markers and draw on top. 
Who needs a mystery box when we can make our own coins? Huh, some mushrooms would be appropriate. And by mushrooms, I mean the chocolate kind. We'll need some red and white frosting. And for the dots, white chocolate chips. <laughs> Wow. wow! I think our cake is ready! It's showtime! <laughs> Surprise, Mario! Here comes the cake! Yeah! Wow! Also, the bride. I wouldn't leave that unattended if I were you. Whoa! Looks like Mario's got a special mystery box bath bomb! Just add water, and look, it's a mushroom with a ring. Okay, Mario, it's time to pick your princess. Take your time, we can get a few seasons out of this. We have a winner. Guess he likes the Cinderella type. But will she accept? Yes, looks like it, congratulations! Still, no time like the present to get the bride ready. And we'll need every second. Some toothpaste will blast those zits. And make your whole self minty fresh. Time for a rinse. Oh, I guess that wasn't hair after all. Eh, it's okay. Mario's got more than enough mustache to share. You might feel a slight pinch. Besides, brunettes have more fun. Once it's all set, it's time to get brushing. But don't forget, your head's not the only place with hair. We need something sticky. Run some chewing gum over those legs. You might want to bite down on something. Oh, that reminds me. We need to get you some shoes. This slime will help give you a nice custom feel. Now add some polish and a heel. A faux fur trim will keep those calves warm. Make two. We can't break up a set. Ooh, tape. This'll be great for our next craft. Take some and roll it around that top. Adding layers until you've got a dress. Now add glue and glitter to get that extra sparkly look. We're ready to go dancing. You're your own disco ball. <laughs> but it still needs a little something. Take some fabric, wrap it around as your brand new sash. It's practically a whole new outfit. Whoa, what do we have here? Toilet paper. Take some and roll it up around a toothpick. Until you get a nice rosette shape. Why not make a whole garden's worth? But our blushing bride needs a tiara too. Here, take a ring for a base and get out your 3D pen. Of course, circlets are fine and all. But for some crowns, the bigger, the better. A few gems won't hurt either. Well, if the crown fits, wear it. All she needs now is a veil. Wait, what's wrong? What? Did we forget something? Oh, right, the groom, who's still in his plumbing clothes. 
Uh-uh, a wedding planner's work is never done. Put those in the wash, or furnace. <laughs> Ew. Let's start with some modeling clay. Now smear it on his torso. Make some slices in a pattern. Add one more for some instant abs. <laughs> Next, that glove should come in handy. Cut off a few of the tips. Ugh, not your own. Now place Mario in his brand new pants. Even comes with coattails. <laughs> Talk about fancy. Next, let's check the closet. Hmm, maybe that third one? Wait, what's that? Huh, this dress shirt might just work. Good idea. The bow tie even matches the hat. Come on, it's time to step down that aisle. I told Donkey Kong to pick that up! Hmm, I think there's something special inside that box. Wow, look at all those bees! Look, they can make a mushroom rainbow! Now it's time for a little ironing. This will help keep it in place. Wow! And now it's the perfect backdrop. Mm. Wow, that nano tape is on a roll. Cut off a piece and pour on some glitter. Now just fold it in half. Next up, we're gonna need some air. So we can blow up a huge bubble. Don't worry, it's not gonna pop. And it'll make for some great decorations. Get that confetti ready. And you can't forget the wedding cake. Though, I wish I could. It's all right. We'll make a new one. Take some marshmallow. Let's add some layers and syrup. Of course, a Mario wedding cake needs a mushroom on top. Now for the special ingredient. A little fire flower power. Kind of a sweet and spicy sort of deal. Let's watch the happy couple cut the cake. Just save some for the rest of us. So much for that facial we gave her. Now it's time for presents. Well, what'd you expect? I mean, you did just marry a plumber. Oh, yep. it's just clay. Maybe we can mold it into something else. Add some foil to make a ball. Why not make two while you're at it? Add a little white clay. Now who's this starting to look like? It's Mario's old pal! Yoshi! He just needs some arms and legs. can be our surprise guest. Quick, put him in the box. Okay, it's time for the big unveiling. Surprise, it's Yoshi. So who wants to go for a ride? Come on, he's a dinosaur built for two. Who's ready for liftoff? Hope you filled up on cake because there's no peanuts on this flight. 
Ah, Yoshi, the only way to travel. Wow, your new home. <sighs> kind of small. Ew. It's time for a little upgrade. Take a plastic bottle. Spray it pink. Now add that party hat on top. Our new tower needs a little door. And some windows. Make a few more, and it's a whole castle. See what a little recycling can do? Now you kids can live happily ever after. Aw, oh, true love. So, is there any cake left? Mario-tastic stuff. Catch you next time. Careful. Oh, you broke a nail. Oh, the whole set, actually. Huh, you can always use an extra hand around the house. The more, the merrier. And with all these hands, it's time to get snapping. Fill it up as much as you want. Can't forget the whitehead. What else can we add? Using what you've got on hand. Very frugal. Just like Grandmama used to whip up. Uh-oh. People should really watch where they're going. Sure, she likes dirt and grime, but it's the principle of the thing. Then again, she's been meaning to give her shoes a new look. Forget diamonds. Spikes are a girl's best friend. Okay, everyone. Make like a shoe and start stepping. Nothing wrong with enjoying a little screen time. Guess you should probably wait until after class. Or get creative. Like with this crafty new phone case. Gym class is always better with snacks. Hey, it's a source of energy. Fine, back to her workout. Like she didn't bring back up candy. Ah, that should carry her over till next period. Nah, a little more shouldn't hurt. Thing has a brand new toy for us. A toy printer. Add an image in need of a makeover. Wow, though I was kind of expecting some color. Run it through again. Oh no! I've never seen something so horrifying! An organized life is a happy... Well, never mind. Might as well help. Look, a pop-it toy! You know, if we take a few of these... Maybe sew them alongside each other... We can make a brand new knapsack. What are we gonna do for the handle? Huh, knew these garters would come in handy. Looking good. This should stop all that crying. Wow. Don't forget to thank her. I was kind of thinking cash. Thread ain't free. Try stretching them as far as you can. Though, she'd probably prefer if they did break. Not that throwing them at the wall isn't a lot of fun, too. Besides, you can practically race them. Let's see who can hit the floor first. Always good to have a few meals between snacks. Hey, what happened to our balanced lunch? We need to beef up security with the help of our little friend here. Our grabby classmates might not want cockroaches in their diet. Maybe if we're lucky, she won't ask for a hall pass. Good idea. Tracking in all that dirt's a great distraction. Why must Wednesday's child be full of woe? Don't worry, 
Here's just the thing to help. And look what he brought. A shoe cover. What you waiting for? Time to show the class your new kicks. Let's give the teacher a closer look. Just pretend it's show and tell. Time for the big math test. Wednesday's a natural. Though she's better at subtracting than adding. I guess Wednesday wants something a little more challenging. Fortunately, more questions are just a stamp away. Look at all those questions. Let's hope there's some division. Something tells me Wednesday's great at dividing things, too. Hmm. Out of paper? Well, time to roll up your sleeves. <laughs> I'd be careful taking a nap around here. Someone might think you're due for a makeover. Aw, is she blushing or is it just me? Funny. Usually, she's the one giving out black eyes. Though I don't think she'd mind all those new teeth. <laughs> Time to wake up, Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> At least she's in good company. Wow, a perfect circle. No wonder she likes him. Then again, where's a compass when you need one? Well, if we don't have one, we can always make one. Just tape your marker to a pair of scissors. And voila! Hey, that's French. It's a perfect circle. <laughs> this purse is a mess. Let's trade up for something smaller. Just take some paper and start folding it up. It's kind of like making a paper fan. Just add some more paper to cover it up. Let's personalize it. Look, it's a unicorn. And look at all those pockets. Time to start filling them up. Wednesday doesn't do rainbows. She prefers monochrome. Let's start from scratch and whip up some new paper. Collect some pieces together. Now we'll need some water. We're gonna need some more. Yeah, that should do it. Stir it up like a witch at her cauldron. And pour the slush onto the machine. Close it up and start cranking away. Now, let's see how our piece of parchment came out. A pair of bones is more her style, but there's no room for a skull. Looks like we need to start from scratch. Enid, would you like a bib? Or maybe a shower? Don't worry, Wednesday has come prepared. This waterproof shirt will protect you from stains. And you can finally wear white after Labor Day. Either we raise money for art class, or we improvise. Hey, Enid, old buddy. Now you don't need to pluck those pesky nose hairs. Now time to make art. Such a perfectly putrid shade of green. Huh, eat me? Well, if it worked for Alice. Ooh, well, on the bright side, at least you're not shrinking. And besides, this looks like an easy fix. Cut out a shape and add some color. Besides, why be Alice when you can be the Queen of Hearts? <laughs> Wednesday's doll is fierce, but she's not allowed in class. Nah. 
It's okay. Wow. We can make our own fun. Hmm. Add some nano tape to a straw. And get blowing. Hmm. Take that bubble and give it a face. Hey. Grab some more tape to make hair. Including pigtails. They're kind of her thing. Now hmm. give her a good squeeze. Okay, not that hard. Who's up for a little garden of bonbon? <laughs> hey, careful with that drink! Uh oh! <laughs> that Opila bird doesn't look too friendly. <laughs> no, not the cage! Quick, you gotta break out! Not like that. What's going on? No humans? We need a way to trick this security system. Hmm, why don't we put that pimple to good use? Let's see if you can break the bars. No? Well then, we'll dig our way out. What? Oh, hey, did you find something? It's an Opila box. Just what we need. Let's start with this extractor. Hmm. And clear up all those zits. <laughs> but now let's clear all that dead skin. There's fresh skin underneath. And I mean real fresh. You're looking a little red in the face. Hmm. Hmm. Yay! You know, I hear eggs are good for skin. Wow. Especially when they come with shiny Yay. face masks. Ew. Wow, that was quick. Uh-oh, uh -oh. mama's back! Uh -oh. We're gonna need to make a replacement. Hmm, whatever this is, it's egg-shaped. It'll just have to do. Quick, make the switch. Do you think she'll fall for it? Uh, guess not. Something tells me that Opila is mad at her. Her glasses! Oh no, she can't see a thing without them. But maybe these drops can help. Or maybe not. Unfortunately, she can't read that warning. Drops aren't supposed to give you red eyes. Now she has Opila's bird vision. Ugh, pretty sure those nose hairs are new. Get some sticky gum, add to a stick, and make like you're digging for gold. Now let's toss those sticks. Great aim, just poor timing. What? Okay, what we need is a distraction. Great idea! Worms! What bird can resist? Now toss that bait. Great success! Quick, grab that other box. Wait, I wouldn't stick my hand there. Uh, uh, uh. Look, in the first box, hmm. plastic wrap. Hmm. Lay down the wrap. Now draw out a face with makeup. Red ruby lips. Add matching eyeshadow. Just remember to close your eyes before putting it on. Might need a little pat here and there. Now peel it off. Ew. Ah, uh, looking good. Yes. I guess everyone's getting makeovers. On the plus side, free shaving what? cream. Oh, 
Gonna shave your head? Hmm. Yay! Wait, no, she's adding color. And lathering it up. Hmm. Now we're gonna need some help. Hey! Come on, Opila Bird. Take the worm. We'll pluck that feather. Uh oh. Now those are some vibrations. Look at your new rosy locks! Now that's worthy of a hair flip! Think it'll be enough to trick the security system? Uh, guess not. Well, when a makeover doesn't work... It just means we're not finished! Now pull on these carnival gloves. Yay! And stick on some feathers. <laughs> right down to your fingers. And why should your arms have all the fun? Yay! Hey, in back of you, something's glowing! What is it? It looks like a drone controller. Huh? Uh, wow. and you know what that means. A drone shouldn't be too far uh, behind. Uh, and while we're at it, let's pick up some chicken on the way. But this is no ordinary chicken. It's a Play-Doh chicken. Ooh, wow. does it lay golden eggs? Yay! No, even better! They're clay! Which we can use to make feathers. Or better yet, a stylish new beak. Just make sure you can breathe. Hmm. Anything else in the box for us? Guess not. But hey, look! It's a plastic bag! Maybe it can help! Hmm. With a few cuts, it's a brand new dress. But it's a little too simple. A little accessorizing never hurt anyone. Like a new belt. A new skirt. Yay! Preening's important when you're a bird. Feeling okay? Wow, you really are a bird. Oh, roll on glitter tattoos. Yay. Let's try them on. Stick them on and don't forget the glitter. Pretty soon, you're your own shining star. Now let's fix up those feet. We're gonna need some new socks. Anything in yellow? Oh, and it's nice and long. It's the perfect thing for a pair of bird legs. Roll them up as high as you can. Now make some holes to hold some feathers. You'll need a little plumage for your tights. Wow. Hey. Maybe this will trick the security system. It worked! Yay. We're on our way out of here. But we're not out of the woods yeah. yet. <laughs> we still have to fool the Opila bird. Hey, that worked too! Let's have some tea and donuts. Aww. Wow, she really didn't need a mouth hole. Opila Bird likes a little music with brunch. 
Time to rock out, but not too hard. Uh-oh. Oh, no! Not the eyebrows! We gotta get out of here! Oh, it was all a dream. So, who's up for some fresh air? Why, it's our friend, the Opila bird. And look, an egg! Wow, it already hatched! Congratulations, it's a doll. Let's get that goop out of your hair. A little cover-up won't hurt. And there's plenty of clay where that came from. Why don't you slip into these? Some pink will add the right touch. And googly eyes. Okay, now I'm starting to see the family resemblance. So, you need a hand? Ugh, let's pop that pimple. And it looks like we're just getting started. Ah, much better. Really got a hand into you. Oh, poor Bon Bon's got a toothache. Don't worry. Maybe it's just something you ate. Seems like it, judging by that smell. Let's drain it and remove these spiders. Still, it's nice seeing you eat your greens. This'll help us take a closer look. Huh, one of these teeth is not like the other. Looks like we need to get you a new one. Good thing she's got a spare. And it's an emerald. We don't want that gem feeling lonely, do we? Here, try out your new chompers. What a mess! Nothing a makeover can't fix. Careful, that hair doesn't grow back. And try not to waste that paste. Excuse us, can you spare a roll? Huh? Toilet paper? Are we making a mummy? Well, either way, wrap her up. Huh, those horns look kind of familiar. Let's just add a coat of paint, a smile, and some googly eyes. Wait, I'd know that pink bow anywhere. It's Bonbolina! Wake up! The nanotape is here! Take a piece. We can blow it up nice and big. Oh, uh, hold on. You need a tissue? Anyway, these'll make great tentacles for our pal Stinger Flynn. And look, we've got a whole aquarium's worth. Come on, Jumbo Josh, work those muscles. No pain, no gain. Okay, hit the showers. Or better yet, why not have a soothing milk bath? This unicorn will help set the mood. Step right in, the milk is fine. Now let's give your face a good wash. A good scrubbing should help too. Grab a loofah, and we're almost done. Well, with the bath. Now it's facial time. Silly Nab Nab, what are you doing in there? Oh, you've got something in your eye. Don't worry, we'll make you a new one. 
roll into a ball, add a pupil, and we're done. <laughs> and I'm sure you've got teeth to spare. <laughs> Is everyone ready for a new adventure? Okay, we need to rethink this. A vacuum bag. Wow. This'll help us make the most of the space we've got. Just suck up all that excess air. See? Now we don't need another suitcase. After all, she needs to carry light. Aw, an egg. And it's ready to hatch. Happy birthday! Oh, is anyone home? Oh. Aluminum foil? Ah, uh, don't worry. Newborns just need a little cleaning up. Just add a beak. Some legs. And it's a baby Okila bird. Come on, let's meet the whole family. Ooh, that squishy's really blowing up. Wait, I think that's too much air. Ew. Where's a wet wipe when you need one? Silly unicorn. I wonder what's inside you. Why, it's Bon Bon. Double the horns, double the fun. Oh, first day at school? Bring enough slices for the whole class? Oh no! Not the cake! It even comes with donuts! Watch out! Well, at least you get frosting. It's my house of cards all over again! Wow, she's a mermaid? Well, back to the ocean she goes. Oh, it's time for lunch. And I think I just lost my appetite. Huh, why don't we grab this plastic wrap and roll out some glue from a glue stick? Wrap it all up, keeping the glue in the middle. And now cover it up again with some paper. Fold it up into small blocks. Now, our little pimple pouches need a face. This'll work, but they still need a little opening. Just poke each one with a toothpick. Wow! Hopefully this'll get all that pimple popping out of his system. Science fair time! The volcano's always a classic. I mean, you did it last year, too. How about a bee? How about you? Oh, a potato light bulb. It works, but he prefers french fries. Still, it's better than nothing. Literal nothing. Maybe this straw can help. Cut it up. Hang some paper clips and add some eyes. Looks like you've got some to spare. Now dunk it in the water. It's our very own Cartesian bottle diver. Give it a squeeze and the little diver goes up and down. And look who's making the honor roll. Amazing. Ah, what a nice, bright, sunny day. Great for schoolwork. Though, maybe we should dim the lights. And I wouldn't mind some air conditioning. But for now, let's do something about that skin. I don't think we can just peel off this problem. 
good idea. Let's use this scale stencil. And brush on some makeup powder. For a new kind of cover-up. Locker check. Oh, what a pretty doll. Ah, uh, she's probably just jealous. Okay, this girl needs a hobby. Why must bad things happen to good dolls? I know, she can be a mermaid too. You know, green tails are just expected. Wait till you see what she's got planned for the legs. And it's time for Fizz Ed. Ooh, careful around all that sweat. On the plus side, we're starting swimming next term. But for now, back to stretching. Maybe there's something that can help. Put on this hair drying cap. And turn on the blow dryer. Good, that should dry you off. Let's hope you studied for the big test. But don't get too worked up. How about this? Take some sand and water. And add them inside a balloon. Tie it up, and it's a stress ball. Here, you might need this. I think somebody needs a napkin. For now, let's clean up that sweater. Or at least cover the stain. Whoa. This shell is just what we need. What else? Oh, good idea, seaweed. Almost done. Just clean that face. Another doll? Well, be careful. This is why toys stay at home. Here, why don't we add on a pop tube? Look, it could be the mermaid's tail. But we're still gonna need a fin. We can make some out of clay. Now scratch out some lines. Add a smaller tube to help it fit. And it's the finishing touch. Oh, someone's writing love notes. Whoops, can't let the teacher see. What our notes need is a little lamination. Add some tape on top of the notes. Now dip the note in some water. Scratch off the paper, and the note survives. Now we just need somewhere to hide it. Oh, like this plastic water bottle. Wait a sec, food's not allowed in here. Let's hope he doesn't notice the note. I guess it's not our lucky day. And this is why you don't fall asleep in class. Hey, don't pin this all on her. Here, take a glue gun and draw on the bottle. 
Now add some paper clip wires. We'll need to cover it up. Add some clay. Now let's add some suction cups. And a big purple head in the middle. Wake up, Mr. Octopus! Nothing out of the ordinary here, sir. Just sitting here with our handy-dandy octopus. Your piece for art class looks great. Oh no, now it's all wet. But maybe that's just the thing this picture needs. And why stop there? Uh-oh, looks like someone needs to go. Too bad that potty is really a cake. Ooh, a wedding cake. Hope no one notices. Quick, the bride! Can't let her see it! Oh, that bought us some time. To fix up that cake, take these chocolate cookies and crumble them up into pieces. Now let's add some milk. Time to squeeze. Mix it up until it becomes a paste. Uh, we should workshop the shape. Remember, we need a potty. Oh, you're quite the sculptor. But the first cake was white. Toilet paper. Ooh, edible toilet paper. Well, let's get wrapping. The bride won't be the only one all dressed in white. Ooh, add some frosting on top for the button. Next, grab some oysters. They just might have pearls. Oh, even better, it's candy. Pearl candy. Add it on top of our little swirl and cover it up. Ooh, cool glasses. Hey, wait a minute, they're pimples. And the goop inside is delicious. Now chop up a bottle and dig a hole. Whoa, we reached the chocolate center. Wow, look at all that money. I know. Why don't we roll it up together? And it can be our secret ingredient. Quick, to the bathroom! Excuse us, Miss Mermaid. But we're gonna need this chocolate plug. Whoops, kinda forgot about the drain. Use it to cover the hole. Oh, hi, Pomni. Sorry, but we're gonna need that lid. Oh, and some hard candies, too. Line them up and melt them into place. Now we've got our very own lid. Complete with a custom-made cover. Gotta go, Turtle. Are you okay? I think he's got something stuck in his throat. Here, why don't you try this instead? It's bite-sized, so it'll go down easy. And speaking of food going down, I think he needs to go. Aw, oh, now he should feel all better. And we've got a special surprise. Mix it up and grab a stencil. Now, we can give this cake some scales. 
I think we need to speed things up. With an even bigger paintbrush. Oh, just look at all the colors! Hey, what's that? Oh, you naughty doggy! Poor Barbie! You ate her legs! Well, maybe she can be a cake topper. But let's give her a jelly bean tail. Now cover it up with melted chocolate. And look, this chocolate comes in all sorts of colors. But it could still use a little edible glitter. Pour it on. Oh, what a pretty mermaid. But now, it's time to go fishing. Ooh, wake up! You've got a bite! What a catch! A giant candy fish! Ah, nothing beats a good fish fry. I think it's ready. Pour it into these little round molds. Make a bunch and add some glitter. Or even better, some edible gold leaf. Give it time to harden into tiny spheres. Add them around the cake in a row. Next up, let's cook up some eggs. And we've got special grade A eggs. Ooh, they've got marshmallows inside. Now let's melt them up until they're nice and gooey. Uh. <laughs> and add your favorite cereal. What else can we add? Ooh, fresh strawberry juice. Mix it all up until everything blends together. Now scoop it out and mold it into shape. Ooh, it's a cute little piece of coral. So realistic, they're bringing in fish. Ooh, I think he had an accident. Aw, it's okay, don't cry. On second thought, keep crying, we can use it. Just add a little bit of gelatin. Give it a good shake. And pour it inside. Cover up our fishy friend. And why don't we crumble up a cookie on top? Wow, this cake is really coming together. But every dessert needs whipped cream. Add some little blobs of frosting. And smear some whipped cream on top. What's going on here? Look at all these hard candies. Collect them in a bowl and melt them up. Just a heads up, this might take a while. Ooh, I think they're done. Let's see. Oh, they all melted into a candy gel. Pour it out over some wax paper. Let it cool, and when it hardens, it's time to get cracking. Come on, put some muscle into it. It's like rock candy. Silly, Omni, it's just candy. Still, we can pretend they're pieces of sea glass.
kind of fits that whole underwater theme we're going for. Wow, this cake looks even better than the old one. It's so good, the bride and groom should owe us a cake. But first, let's put it back into place. And just in time, they're about to cut the cake. What's wrong? Oh no, that's not... Oh, never mind. Omni can make the next cake. Hey, careful, don't pick at it. Even if it is candy. Told you so. What a nightmare. You think too much candy's to blame? Yeah, me neither. This cute unicorn holds all your candy secrets. Press the tail and see what happens. Mmm, bite-sized treats. Now let's add some melted chocolate inside. Uh-oh, I think that was too much. It's litter box time. Oh well, chocolate is chocolate. Wow. That gummy bear is an Ursa Major! <laughs> Why don't we heat things up? Once it's melted, you can make bubbles that'll last forever. Well, they would if they weren't so delicious. Now let's try the direct approach. Quick, catch it! There it is! Hmm, something smells... sweet? Wow, chocolate heels! And this shoe can hold a whole lot of whipped cream. Now this is a treat you can really put your foot in. Just be careful where you step. Happy birthday! Make a wish! The birthday girl gets the first slice. Oh, it melted! Melted! I guess it really is a cotton candy cake. The whole thing just melts away. Wait, there's something inside. Mmm, and it tastes like chocolate. Oh, jelly mermaid sashimi. Have a bite. Hmm. It's the catch of the day. These are good, but be careful. You don't want to eat too much. <laughs> Tired of the same old candy? Well, that looks interesting. An egg! Let's get cracking. Oh, I wanted a chocolate egg. Well, we can't live on candy alone. Let's put it in a mold and cook it up. Don't forget the sauce. And eat.
Think there's more where that came from? Next up, we've got a squishy maker. Add a balloon and blow it up nice and big. Now add all your favorite candy inside. Any shape and size, as long as it fits. Now pour in some soda. Seal it up nice and tight. And you've got yourself a squishy. Ooh. Wow, just look at all those colors. Still, we can't let good candy go to waste. Ah, nothing beats freshly squeezed. Strawberries are nature's candy. But there's always room for improvement. Make a few cuts. And it's a rose in bloom. But now for a big caramel candy dip. After all, why should apples have all the fun? A rose by any other name wouldn't taste as great. Now let's try some grapes. And bring the caramel to them. Add a stick inside, let it dry, and sink your teeth in. Mmm, fruit never looked so good. Someone could use a wet nap. Well, a dino grabber's great for a hands-off experience. It kind of reminds me of a claw game. Except you win every time. There's even a bonus prize in the back. Honestly, you get the best of both ends. Oh, look, he's got your nose. Oh, you've got a little something. We've got just the thing you need. A candy toothbrush. Add some paste. Now get brushing. Or just eat it. Really get those bristles in there. Hmm, I think you could use some more paste. Nothing says happiness on a silver platter like some jiggly jelly rabbits. Oh, they're extra squishy. <laughs> but they're not too squishy to sink your teeth into. Pretty soon, you'll have an Easter party right in your tummy. <laughs> hey, watch your step. <laughs> hmm. What's that smell? <gasps> Quick, let's follow the scent. Bet something sweet's in that box. Plain donuts. Well, we can fix that. Mush them together into a giant donut. Lay it down for a whole lot of icing. Time for some toppings, like rainbow sprinkles. <laughs> hmm, 
Now that's a donut. Have a bite. This might take a while. But it won't be here for long. Ooh, Ooh nice nails. Just the thing for our jelly candies. They really liven up your <laughs> manicure. And they're great for a quick snack. You can eat them as is. But they're great for dipping, too. Why not try all three? Wow! And when you're done with one finger, remember, you've got nine more. Oh, a lollipop windmill! It's five flavors in one! While also being a windmill. Ah, now that's a cool breeze. But if you think that's good, wait until you taste it, too. Walking on tippy toes is truly an art form. Whoops! Oh no! Is the cake okay? Wow. But first things first, let's fix you up some fresh new footwear. Add some polish and remove that balloon. Dance the night away in these glass shoes. Unfortunately, everyone's gonna want them. Uh oh. Hey, look, it's another cake! Isn't it usually the other half that goes on top? Must be one of those upside down cakes. <laughs> wow! Throw her a donut lifesaver, and now it's a day at the beach. <laughs> There's more than one way to decorate a cake. Take a macaroon, open it up, and add some extra filling. Add some layers and top with a doll. Now let's add some candy pearls to make it extra fancy. Ice cream's great, but save that cone. Give it a dip in melted chocolate. And it can make any cupcake into a shoe. Remember, when it comes to shoes, you can't stop at one. Wow, what pretty <laughs> shoes! Oh, inspiration strikes! And for once, you'll want to step in gum. Now fill up the shape with syrup and let it dry. Now they'll make perfect cake decorations. Make a bunch, but they can each be one of a kind. Time for yeah. a trim. Don't get any hair on the cake. Now turn on an electric mixer. We're making cotton candy. A home perm never looked better. Or more importantly, tasted better. Next up, grab yeah. a plastic bottle. <laughs> Poke some holes in a row. We're gonna need more than that. <laughs> Place some fondant inside. It's gonna need a little push. Let it come out in a bunch of strands. Now tie it up into a long braid to decorate the cake. But don't forget the most important part. Care needs accessories. 
like a big red ball. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, let's have some fun with a pastry gun. Add some paper shapes along the cake. Now spray on some color around the shapes. Hang on, I think you missed a spot. Peel off the paper and the shapes stay on. <laughs> We're gonna add a sheet to this cake. Huh? And add little piles of colorful candy. <sighs> now all you need is some water. And the rainbow spreads out. Peel it off and the colors seep through. Brings new meaning to sheet cake. Uh -huh. Now let's get some sugar beads. <laughs> Put them in this little device. And we can fill up those shapes we've made. <laughs> Next up, mm -hmm. take some gummy wipes. <laughs> and place them in an injector. Now it's time to bring the heat. So we can make a bunch of gummy droplets. And if baking doesn't pan out, we can always make lava lamps. Just kidding. Collect those little drops <laughs> and use them to decorate the outline of the cake. Wow, spheres must really be in season. Mm, with some soft plastic chocolate, you can make it into all sorts of shapes. Especially with the right cookie cutter. Just peel it out of the shape Don't eat it, nope. even if it is chocolate. It can add a splash of something special to the cake. <laughs> huh? <laughs> but there's more than one way to shape chocolate. Melt it, draw what you want, and give it an ice bath. Should be long enough. Huh? Add to the cake. Make as many as you want. Ooh, a lollipop! And it comes with different dips. Add some marshmallows around it. And you've got a candy flower. So, how does your garden grow? But with our handy pastry bag, we can make a squirt on a stick. Now for some glitter sugar. Little more. Make a bunch and add to the cake. And with this special rolling pin, we're saving a bunch on cookie cutters. Besides, it takes a light touch to make a pattern. Now let's cover those shapes with syrup. Make sure you stay inside the lines. Are we making carrot cake? Oh, I see. You're carving out a shape. Uh -huh. Dip it in some melted chocolate and use it as a stamp. <laughs> you can make a whole sea of stars. 
Hmm. Huh? Oh, what a cute little horse. And this rainbow can be its mane. Of course, every unicorn needs a horn. Huh? Make a whole herd of unicorn cupcakes. Wow, this cake is really coming together. Now we're going to need some cream. Pour it out in a line and add more to the side. That should be enough. Roll it up. Now make a bunch of little swirls. It's just the final touch our cake needed. It's fun in the sun on top. And the rest is pretty and pink. But no one can feel blue with a cake like this either. In fact, it's a true blue beauty. Which cake do you like better? Though personally, I'd pick both. Hey, princess! This time, Mario's got a cake for you. You got a boy. So you win the blue box. Let's see what you've won. Candies! You've hit the jackpot. Oh, hey, watch your step. Ugh, I think it's stuck. Well, I guess if the gummy bear fits, wear it. Now let's dip it inside some pink chocolate. And nonpareils, the glitter of the candy world. These shoes look good enough to eat. So have a bite. Will you save me a heel? Ah, cotton candy. So fluffy, so delicious, but not so good in water. Hey, what's that? No wonder it's so fluffy. It's full of secrets. Mostly cute animals with squishy bottoms. And it tastes great, too. Look, Mario, your very own castle. Now he knows what it's like to be a Goomba. Looks like new digs for the gummy worms. How about we make things warm and toasty for you? Wow, that really brought them all together. Let's clean you off. Aw, oh, he's even got the stash. But let's hope he still tastes like a gummy. This doll is all dressed up and ready to go. Ugh, guess I jinxed it. Well, it's okay. I'm sure we can whip something new up. Let's start with a simple wrap for the top. Now for the bottom. Let's make you a skirt. I guess you like the long style. Wow! But if you prefer short, we can fix that. Oh, so many toilets. Good thing there's a plumber in the house. Ugh. How about we start with a clean lollipop? Let's try all three flavors. Now take a lick. And remember, it's okay to double dip. I mean, they're your toilets. Or you can enjoy right from the source. Marshmallows are so yummy. But unfortunately, I don't eat anything with a face. Hey, wait a second. Well, 
He sure makes for a familiar-looking kebab. But after a nice little chocolate bath, you wouldn't even recognize him. Our little friends sure do make a nice bouquet. Honestly, a fruit salad has never looked better. Strawberry pencils are already great. But here's a fun way to twist it up. Literally, twist it up with other flavors. Now for a black coating. Some candy rice. Some candy salmon. And it's candy sushi. Slice it up. It's all in the presentation. And enjoy. Delicious cream filling. Hey, what was that? I think something or someone is under the blanket. Must be Grandma. She's got hand candy. And it's the cream-flavored kind. Looks like there's enough to go around. Whoops, I guess she doesn't think so. Well, do we have a treat for her? Squishy toys are so much fun. Just don't push your luck. Oh, it's okay. We can fill them back up again. Just give them some air. Blow them up. This time, let's use all different candies and sweets. Now for some juice to help wash it all down. Ooh, it's all sealed up. Let's get squishing. Wow. Of course, we can't let all those treats go to waste. One of these things is not like the others. That's more like it. They should be safe to bite now. Good thing they aren't jawbreakers. Ooh, bubble gum. This has potential. So who's up for a little badminton? Gesundheit. Wow, you really are what you eat. Save some sprinkles. Now melt up some hard candies. And then drizzle it all on top. We need to fill up the mold. Add a stick before it hardens. And you've got a fancy new lollipop. For extra fancy, nothing beats a chocolate dip. But remember, the real secret ingredient is love. Sweet stuff. Catch you next time. Aha! So that's where rainbow slime comes from. We know just where to put it. Press the tail and watch what happens. Unicorn candy. And there's plenty for all. This girl's all hooves. It's always nice to have a little friend on hand. Just be careful where you step. Then again, at least your hand's clean. Of course, if you don't own a unicorn, you can always make one. Draw it. And cut out four holes for legs. Now let's take her for a stroll. And strum a guitar while we're at it. Next up, a toilet? There's a surprise inside. 
It looks like we need to start drilling. Hey, there's a little unicorn inside. Now that's jaw-dropping. I didn't mean that literally. Poor lollipop. I know. Just grab a toy toilet. Maybe make it into a unicorn. And it can hold your lollipop for you. You keep plushies in the fridge? Well, that should keep it fresh. Ooh, we're gonna need to lance that. Hey, I think there's something inside. You keep your ponies in the strangest places. Well, the herd's all here. Ooh, Pinkie Pie. Here's an idea. Empty a jar. And fill it up with glitter and water. Mostly water. Now dunk that little pony in with the cork on top and give it a good shake. Remind me to get some unicorn diapers. Still, they're kind of cute. Give it a good squeeze. And it's another unicorn. And this one's got big, beautiful wings. Hey, don't get jealous. Get crafting. Just pour out some melted candy. Wrap it up in a strip of nanotape. Twist it up like strawberry soft serve. Add a face, wings, and a horn? Well, it's still a cutie. Hey, don't stick your gum there. Eh, it's your desk. But let's hope your squishy doesn't pick up any of your bad habits. While we're on the subject, got you gum? Even better, a balloon. Twist it up like a little pouch. Add a familiar face on top and blow a big bubble. Wow, those are some stretchy unicorns. In fact, you can stretch the whole rainbow. Just be careful when you fling them. Thanks, but we can make our own. Add lights inside a poppet tube. And two halves make a whole unicorn. Now it's time to do the twist. Money? Just the thing for our poppet purse. Plus a few of your favorite accessories. And the best part. You can pop it. Not to mention, it goes with everything. Of course, you can always use paper. Make some fans and bind them together. It could use a few equine touches. Now release the rainbow and enjoy your new wallet. Plus, all those fans come in handy on a hot day. Open your present. It's a unicorn. What else? This one might have wings, but this unicorn prefers to hoof it. 
Come on, little filly, strut your stuff. Guess she doesn't like to share. No matter, all we need's a TP roll. Just add some legs on the side. And soon, we've got a rocking horse. Ooh, make that a rocking unicorn. Come on, let the fun rock and roll. This unicorn's got a special power, bubble power. Come on, let's fill up the whole room. Just keep your bubbles to yourself. Oh no, you dropped your drink. At least we've got the straw. Cut it up into pieces. And lay them on some tape. Now roll them up together. And add another straw on back. You've got a unicorn bubble wand. She's got good coverage, but that phone could use a whole new look. This looks like a job for our handy unicorn mold. Pour in some hot glue. And it's your phone's new mascot. Better add jewels before it gets lonely. Ooh, let's see your phone. Hmm, it could use a whole new look too. Almost good enough to eat. Still, it needs a unicorn. You might have noticed the theme. Ah, much better. Now tell all your friends. That or text. All right, time to start the day with a nice shower. Well, it is pretty, but I'd get someone to look at that water. Though it kind of goes with her hair. Perfect thing after a shower? A bath. Never can be too clean. Something tells me this cloud has a special surprise for us. Wow, it doesn't just fizz, it emits a rainbow, just like that. Talk about your double rainbow. Cool, look at all these colored pencils. Can you hold them all? You could just use one at a time, but where's the fun in that? Instead, we'll add it to the bottom of these flip-flops. Kind of like a mix between platform shoes and cleats. Now you can make art with a morning jog. If only you had more than two feet. Look at all that white food. Even the chocolate's white. But there's a little color in the corner. Skittles. Guess she likes them extra crispy. Now it's time to make some popcorn. It's perfect for when you can't decide on salty or sweet. Hey, be careful with that skirt! Oh yeah, huh? tablecloths are great for makeshift clothes. That and curtains, especially when it's made of tool fabric. First, make a knot, and then make a few more. Now take your new tutu for a spin. Hair like this is a labor of love. Oh, wait a minute! Oh no! Quick, maybe we can call the salon! <laughs> or I guess you could just do that. Still, I wonder what we can do with these beads. Add a little bit of heat and melt them together. 
Before it dries, roll it up into your new ring. Don't forget, we have a lot of leftover beads. Remember, fashion is fleeting, but style is eternal. But pulling off white shoes might prove a challenge. Some shaving cream might help, but we still need some color. Now that's more like it. Taste the rainbow and smush everything together. She's so excited, she's gonna put them on as is. Of course, a little water never hurt anybody. These shoes are a tie-dye masterpiece. She doesn't look too happy, does she? You probably could have just used the ones in the bag. Luckily, Ms. Rainbows here has a plan for them. Just melt them into different colors and pour them into a rainbow parfait. This should put a smile on her face. After all, she liked those gummies the first time. Hey, watch where you're going! Oh no! Her shoes! Luckily, this girl always has a colorful trick up her sleeve. Brick by brick, we now have a brand new pair of pumps. Hey, you sure you weren't reaching for the toilet paper? Good, and this will help against those cold bathroom floors. Plus, decorations! Mmm, ice cream. Hmm, kind of expected rainbow sherbet. And not melted. I demand a refund. That's just false advertising. Anyway, we can still fix it up with different colored chocolate. Just give it a dip. And it comes with a little shield of sorts. Maybe she should start her own stamp. Happy birthday! Oh, don't cry. Sketchbooks are fun. After all, the fun is adding your own special splash of color. And adding all these colors is just the start. When this paint dries, we can just scratch the colors back to the surface. Something like this needs to be put on display. There's a time for work and a time for play. Ah, this is boring. When's playtime again? Of course, any time is a good time for inspiration. This pom-pom border will make anything look cute and fuzzy. Nature gives us a variety of colors, and so does the Easter Bunny. What do you think's inside it anyway? Either it'll dissolve, or the fish will have something new to play with. Or maybe it's just enough to break it ourselves. What a cute toy. Let's give it a nice dip. <laughs> and our cute little sea pony ain't little no more. Hey, who doesn't love playing with sponges? Time for a fashion montage. It's nice and simple, mm -mm. but simple ain't style here. We just need to make some cuts. 
Add some beads to bring color to all this fringe. Probably should wash your hands. Huh, those nails need a little something special. If you have a bunch of different nail polish colors, why not put them all to use? Come on, what other nail file would she have? Rainbow, amazing stuff. Catch you next time. Hmm, making cookies? No, we're playing with Play-Doh. And making a whole batch of new friends. Just be careful when you squeeze them. I'm sure that'll wash right out. Joke's on you, she's keeping the bucket. Just look what's inside, tape. And chocolate, the pre-melted kind. Let's bring these two great things together. Now just seal it up nice and tight. And we've got our own little buddy. Ain't he a stinker? The circus? No, even better, candy. Talk about bite-sized. Have some more. Ooh, it's on a roll. And speaking of circus, look, it's our old pal Pomni. And she's got a surprise inside. It's rainbow candy. And it's pre-chewed. Now that's a time saver. Ooh, looks like a baby banana's on its way. Now, you might feel a slight pinch. Aw, happy birthday. Wow, now that's what I call a bouncing baby banana. I know, let's make a banana mold. Fill it with googly eyes and hot glue. Let it dry, and pretty soon, we've got twins. Make that triplets, probably fraternal. Ooh, it's Q, and in plushy form. Well, she sure makes an impression. But he could still use a good wash. Well, it's time for the rinse cycle. Aw, oh, he's her little cutie pie. Looks like A's going through a phase. He needs a haircut and a dermatologist. Acne patches save the day. Now let's brush those teeth. And A's back on his A game. Ooh, we'd better call a plumber. Ew. But first, let's cover it up with popping buttons. Well, they're not gonna pop themselves. Hmm. Don't be jealous. Just grab an old gum pack. And our pal P wants to play too. You know, she always wanted an 8-pack. <laughs> Time to clear the table, cause we've got rocking toys. Knock them down, and they spring right back up. Or, you can grab an old eggshell, add a little something inside, and let the good times roll. Is that a camera? No, it's a bubble machine. Let's get popping. Wow. And if
If you really like bubbles, cut up some straws into tiny pieces. And stack them together in a circle. Oh, look! Add an eye and it's... Oh! And he's your new bubble wand. Don't hold your breath. Blow a big bunch of bubbles. What's wrong? Oh, I see. There's a pincher on the loose. And he's got a need for speed. But don't worry. Grab some supplies. And we can whip up some imitation crab. We'll start with some nice big eyes. And every crab needs claws. It's even got that great fishy smell. What a cute mouse. And look, one good squeeze and he'll help you put on your glitter. Well, slime's cool, but here's an idea. Grab an old plastic glove, add a face. Now place it inside a plastic cup. Add a straw, and you'll have a new friend that'll always give you a hand. Oh, a caterpillar! And just look at those eyes! Well, all we need is some balloons. Blow one up and cut up the other. Bring them together and draw some eyes. All that's left is to give it a good squeeze. Jeepers creepers, where'd you get those eyes? Ooh, slime! Feels so squishy! You know what else is squishy? Play-Doh! Especially when we play with all sorts of colors. Look at all our new little buddies! Ooh, watch where you step! It's Candy Unicorn! She just loves rainbows! And out comes the candies! Oh, now that's tart! Now for some chocolate. Ooh, this will be a special delivery. Fill up this box with sanding sugar. We've got chocolate swirls, and they're squishy. Now that's interactive viewing. And look! A television man! How about we help them unwind and unwrap? Ooh, if we want to see who's inside, this is going to take some serious digging. It looks familiar. I think it's the letter A. We've got a special job for you. Our brand new ruby red pasta. We won't even need tomato sauce. Aw, oh, our squishy unicorn's hungry. Let's make sure we fill her up. Don't forget something to wash it all down. Uh-oh, I think we overdid it a bit. 
Well, at least it's sparkly. Open the curtains. It's our old friend, the acrobat. Now he's Kane the Ringmaster. Wow, he's great at impressions. Uh-oh, use a pancake. Well, maybe we can fix him up. Scratch away all those eye crusts. And let's try a face mask. It's time to shed your skin. And look, you're fluffy again. Wow, unicorns grow up so fast. But that's more than enough fluff. You'll feel better after a quick shave. In fact, there's plenty of leftover fluff to make a whole new unicorn. Sink or swim, these guys float. Hey, it's our alphabet friends. And they come in different sizes. The bigger they are, the more they crackle. soon, you'll forget which letter's which. In fact, why don't we take all these letters and mold them up into a whole new one? Look, it's a great big letter A. Give us a smile. Ooh, kinetic sand. And it's filled with beads. Scoop up the sand and we've got grapes. Cover it up with clear slime and let's get squishing. And who says you need to use your hands? Ooh, that's no soda, it's honey. Hmm, honey's great on its own. But let's mix it with some fruit. Try to blend it up from the inside. And now pour it inside the honey. Add a bottle top and start squeezing. Hmm, looks like we're mixing soap and shaving cream. This seems fun, but we can go bigger. Add shaving cream to a bin. And add the rainbow. Now plop some white shoes in. And let's try them on for size. A quick rinse will clear things up. Wow, look at the colors. Ooh, that's one messy ear pod. Put it inside the container and seal it up. Take a 3D pen and draw on top. We're using all sorts of colors. It's a little pink unicorn. Add some rings. It's a backpack just for Dolly. Mmm, her secret snack, pretzels. Hey, you got pretzels in the chocolate spread. Oh, what a great idea even if it is a little messy.
Okay, we might need to rethink this. Our foam food container will do the trick. Cut out all sorts of different shapes. And soon, we've got stencils. Add on top of those stains. Now start spraying some paint. Soon, everything looks brand new. Ooh, a strawberry? Sugar? Well, let's blend it up. And we've got candied fruit on a stick. Have a lick. What other fruit should we try? In fact, why don't we mash up some fruit? Swirl it up. And now add your favorite soda. Keep on stirring. Then collect up a sample. We've got just the machine for our concoction. But we're not making candy. It's our own candy face mask. Ooh, balloon after balloon. Now it's ice. There's something inside. Open it up. Oh, it looks like a flower. And it still smells as sweet. Now cut the stems. And dip in colored water. Soon you've got a rainbow rose. It'll be the star of the whole bouquet. A round cake? Wow. Oh, please, we can do better than that. Cut out a shape, like so, and add a fondant hat. And maybe a few more final touches. Look, it's -a me, Mario! <laughs> but we're not finished yet. Mario's ready to get his groove on. Wow. <laughs> Look at all this candy. Wow, an ice bear. I wonder if he knows any polar bears. It's bath time. Add some tapioca pearls and a nice splash of milk. Now it's time for the rinse cycle. Him. It's tea time. Ice tea time. Mmm, chocolate. Oh, you're breaking out. Oh, that gives me an idea. Fill a jelly candy with cream. And cover it up with fondant or marzipan. Now give your candy zit a good squeeze. You can use different colors for the fillings. And squeezing them sure is fun. Wow! But the real fun's in eating them. Oh, look! It's our friend, the candy unicorn! Fill him up with candy. He's part pinata. And press that tail when you want your candy back. Now let's try it out with chocolate. Looks like we're doing it fondue style. Oh, we've got chocolate covered candies. You can practically taste the magic. Wow, look at all that cotton candy. Just add water and you win a prize. It's a micro cooler. Fill up the tank. 
Put it all together and pour yourself a drink. Wow! When it comes to this girl and lollipops, she likes to go big or go home. So let's melt up some caramel candies. And pour it up inside this mold. Quick, add a stick before it dries. Wow! You know, that flat side could come in handy. Remember, all the cool lollipops have wrappers. Next up, it's time to try some chewing foam. First, let's see how it tastes. Now let's get to chewing. And blowing! Guess somebody burst their bubble. Oh, Freddy's seen better days. So has this waffle cone. Let's dip it in chocolate and put the cone back together. Now add some more chocolate. But what else can we add wow. to it? Hmm. Crumble up some cookies and give it a good roll. You know, with the right touches, it can be a witch's hat. Wow. Either way, what's a cone without ice cream? <laughs> eh? Wow, edible paper! And we've got edible ink, too! Well, what you waiting for? Let's get sketching! I wonder what she's drawing. Ooh, a burger! With all the toppings! Wow! On second thought, maybe we should call it a flatbread. Mm -hmm. Pucker up! Mm -hmm. Ah, unicorns! Aren't they dreamy? <laughs> oh, he laid an egg! Didn't know they did that! Mm -hmm. Oh, careful now! Eh, it seems alright. Just clear off all that slime. And see what makes him tick. A rainbow! So that's what unicorns are made of. Hey, wait, what's going on? Wow, guess being a unicorn's contagious. Don't worry, that's just the toilet cozy. See, there's just candy inside. Complete with an even tinier toilet. I wonder how this thing works. Well, let's start by opening it up. Why don't you try the powder? Think it's good now. Dip in a lollipop. And there's no shame in double dipping. So cute. Look out, there's a train coming. Run! Fly! Do something! Oh, no! He's half the horse he used to be. It's okay. A pop tube will make him good as new. Oh, someone's had a growth spurt. Looks like he's in good company. Hey, wow. it's raining bubbles! It's all thanks to our unicorn <gasps> bubble maker. Wow. Try to pop as many as you can. Because there's plenty more where that came from. <laughs> wow. 
Someone's got a case of Butterfingers. Ooh, that toy's seen better days. This is gonna take a whole lot of elbow grease. Ditch the slime and let's get scrubbing. Uh-oh, his fur's coming out. Eh, a nice shave's always in style. You know, this guy's so sweet. Why don't we make him a friend? Always good to make friends. It's always best to stay inside the lines. Especially when it's your racetrack. But we can still make a few additions. Ooh, anyone else getting dizzy? Either way, we have a winner. Ooh, I wonder what that could be. Wow, Orbeez! And they're falling from the sky! Oh no! Your ears! We need to get organized. Our double-sided tape should help. We can use it to make a little case. Now scoop up those little beads. Oh, sorted by color. Close it up. And the best part, it's great for squeezing. A unicorn in the wild. But not for long. He's tiny. But why throw him back when we can blow him up ourselves? Let's get pumping. Oh, need a tissue? Unicorn sneeze? Hmm, makes sense. Of course, it's slime when they've got a cold. Either way, it's going in. Now we could use some shaving cream. Maybe some pieces of chocolate? And something to help wash it all down. Headphones? Eh, why not? Now seal it up. And your unicorn's ready for squeezing. Oh, texting someone? Uh-oh, he's gone ghost. Okay, we're tearing up his photo. But let's make it extra fun by turning it into a puzzle. This'll help you save face. Besides, if you patch things up, it's no big deal. You can put everything back together. And remember, corner pieces are your friends. Everything's coming together. That's one way to drop a call. Well, at least it's pretty colors. Maybe we should spread it out. Add some laminate. And now, some glue. Cover it up with glitter. Now blow. Wow. <laughs> it's the perfect phone for when you're feeling creative. What a big bubble. Ouch! What was that? Ouch! Oh, what a naughty unicorn. 
But he's great for target practice. Try something small and round. Great catch! Now for something with a little more bounce. Hey, her hands are clean! Just kidding! Time for round two! Are those wings? She's got wings! And I think she's in good company. Place him up and pull the string. And your dragon takes to the skies. Wait, a dragon took to the skies? Run! Eh, on second thought, he's not so tough. All this popping's thirsty work. Here's an idea. Use that straw to fill up your poppet toy. Freeze it and pop out all those ice buttons. Oh, it tastes like her favorite flavor. All of them. Oh no, I think you broke your marker. No matter, grab your emergency clay. Forget the smell. Just roll it up into a ball. And draw a cute little face on top. Make a bunch, and they're your new marker shell. Remember, these faces may look soft. But they won't crack under pressure. What's inside our A balloon? It's A! Our alphabet's really coming together. And each letter gets their own bubble. Of course, some are big enough to share. Silly dolly, don't hide your face. It's just the thing for our new craft. Just add glue and a paper clip. And it's your new pendant. Oh, poor baby. Almost thought you were a strawberry. All you need is a little TLC. And our magic cloth. Just add water and watch it grow. Wow, you're looking better already. And your temperature's good too. Even got your appetite back. Gotta love bath toys, especially this golden shark. And he's a treasure shark, too. You might feel a slight pinch. And look, there's a treasure chest. Just add water to open it up. Fish bones? Anything else in here? Hmm, let's clear it off. Is it a kazoo? A torpedo? No. It unlocks the shark. Wow, it's a skeleton shark rider. Come on in, the water's fine. Ooh, a miniature crane machine. Wow, you got two for one. And that's not all. They glow in the dark. But let's keep them all together. We're gonna need another bowl. Look at that! 
It's a soda you can eat. And it comes in different flavors. Yeah, she's got a sweet tooth. Hey, what's that underneath? It's a big squishy tube with milkshakes. But let's see what makes it tick. Well, can't have milkshakes without milk. And soda, too? Well, hope you're thirsty. <laughs> oh, why must bad things happen to good soda? Well, at least we still got the bottle. And our <laughs> old pal, Wade. He looks thirsty. Oh, don't cry, Wade. We know what'll cheer you up. Or should I say, who? It's Ember. Is someone chopping up onions? And speaking of onions, they're a look like ogres. It's lunchtime. Oh no, fruits and veg. But the crawling bugs can stay. We've got plenty of wall for them. Hey, personal space is appreciated. Granted, not everyone likes bugs. But these guys are here to stay. Ooh, a sticker machine. Well, let's make some stickers. Oh, let's add a photo, too. Place it on top and close the machine. It's like a little snow globe sticker. And look, it also works on shells. Just add resin. And since we've got all this resin, we can make liquid drop stickers. And don't forget, stickers are for sticking. <laughs> Luigi! Huh, a plumber's work is never done. He's gone. Oh, there he is! And he's on a pen. And he's going for a ride. Just in time for the big test, too. Well, it's an A for effort. And not much else. Shame there's no restart button. Where there's money, Mr. Krabs isn't far behind. Never knew Eugene was so slimy. SpongeBob's here too, and he's golden. Add some gummy bears inside, and he'll give them a good squeeze. <laughs> well, can't let gummies go to waste. When it comes to candy, go big or go home. <laughs> Wait, this isn't a real lollipop. And it's filled with white goo. Let's stick it in our balloon maker. Add some gummies while we're at it. Little more candy, soda wouldn't hurt. Now seal it up and get squeezing. Mmm, corn on the cob. Take a bite. Oh, yeah. Hope those were baby teeth. Well, here's an idea. Grab some nano tape. Take a piece, color it yellow. And roll it up into a tube. 
Now cut it up into little kernels. Bring them together and add a leaf. It's a brand new ear of corn. You can't exactly eat it. But it's still fun to pop. Huh? Happy birthday! Time to cut the cake. Wait, that's no cake. Is it even your birthday? Wait, there's something inside. It's a plastic mold. It's a little bear you can fill with rainbow sand. Fill it up and let it soak. And the bear stays intact. And look, he's brought friends. Hey, did you feel something? Oh, it's a bunny ball shooter. Uh-oh, they've joined forces. <laughs> and they've just found their target. Duck! Also, you should hide. <laughs> the bunny has found its match. Or maybe not. Either way, I think they're finished. Hmm. One of these plants is not like the others. It's a candy tree. So let's add some candy. Keep rolling until the fruit blossoms. And why not add some toppings? Wow! Looks like a good harvest this year. Aha! So that's where rainbow slime comes from. We know just where to put it. Press the tail and watch what happens. Unicorn candy! And there's plenty for all. This girl's all hooves. It's always nice to have a little friend on hand. Just be careful where you step. Then again, at least your hand's clean. Of course, if you don't own a unicorn, you can always make one. Draw it. And cut out four holes for legs. Now let's take her for a stroll. And strum a guitar while we're at it. Next up, a toilet? There's a surprise inside. It looks like we need to start drilling. Hey, there's a little unicorn inside. Now that's jaw dropping. I didn't mean that literally. Poor lollipop. I know. Just grab a toy toilet. Maybe make it into a unicorn. And it can hold your lollipop for you. You keep plushies in the fridge? Well, that should keep it fresh. Ooh, we're gonna need to lance that. Hey, I think there's something inside. You keep your ponies in the strangest places. Well, the herd's all here. Ooh, Pinkie Pie. Here's an idea. Empty a jar. 
and fill it up with ah. glitter and water, mostly water. Now dunk that little pony in, with the cork on top, and give it a good shake. Remind me to get some unicorn diapers. Still, they're kind of cute. Give it a good squeeze. And it's another unicorn! And this one's got big, beautiful wings. Hey, don't get jealous. Get crafting. Just pour out some melted candy. Wrap it up in a strip of nanotape. Twist it up like strawberry soft serve. Add a face, wings, and a horn? Well, it's still a cutie. Hey, don't stick your gum there. Eh, it's your desk. But let's hope your squishy doesn't pick up any of your bad habits. While we're on the subject, got your gum? Even better, a balloon! Twist it up like a little pouch. Add a familiar face on top and blow a big bubble. Wow, those are some stretchy unicorns. In fact, you can stretch the whole rainbow. Just be careful when you fling them. Thanks, but we can make our own. Add lights inside a poppet tube. And two halves make a whole unicorn. Now it's time to do the twist. Money? Just the thing for our poppet purse. Plus a few of your favorite accessories. And the best part. You can pop it! Not to mention, it goes with everything. Of course, you can always use paper. Make some fans and bind them together. It could use a few equine touches. Now release the rainbow and enjoy your new wallet. Plus, all those fans come in handy on a hot day. Open your present. It's a unicorn. What else? This one might have wings, but this unicorn prefers to hoof it. Come on, little filly. Strut your stuff. Guess she doesn't like to share. No matter, all we need is a TP roll. Just add some legs on the side. And soon, we've got a rocking horse. Ooh, make that a rocking unicorn. Come on, let the fun rock and roll. This unicorn's got a special power, bubble power. Come on, let's fill up the whole room. Just keep your bubbles to yourself. Oh no! You dropped your drink! At least we've got the straw. Cut it up into pieces. And lay them on some tape. Now roll them up together. And add another straw on back. You've got a unicorn bubble wand.
<laughs> She's got good coverage. But that phone could use a whole new look. This looks like a job for our handy unicorn mold. Pour in some hot glue. And it's your phone's new mascot. Better add jewels before it gets lonely. Ooh, let's see your phone. Hmm, it could use a whole new look too. Almost good enough to eat. Still, it needs a unicorn. You might have noticed the theme. Ah, much better. Now tell all your friends. 